Oh. Test number two, I'm trying to do a bit of a freehand uh, thing here with the, the camcorder and see if I don't have to use zoom and all that type of stuff and we'll see how it goes. Also until I get a better tripod, I'm going to see if I can do a bit more freehand stuff and uh, go from there. But uh, it is test number two due to the fact that um, I just clued in, I got to keep my finger away from the stop button when I'm trying to record. So here's some three uh, three replacement points coming here. It's uh, right now what I'm trying to do uh, is just kind of a, a I'm gonna probably take some pictures later. Is um, there's going to be an awful lot of movement? I was really surprised, actually. Well, a lot of it's just gonna be shifting of uh, strength points over for the Austrians. However, I'll try to go over. Is that um, there is going to be some. So I am going to try to mount an attack here um, and I'm going to do it in an interesting way for me anyways to keep with the narrative and uh, yet again like I've said before it's got nothing to do with um, Der Weltkrieg and it could be implausible historically this is not the way they did command and control and so on and so forth. I'll learn uh, but right now this is the way, the way I'm going about it. Um, so first army is going to mount an attack uh, over here and of course they're across the river so that would be a no-no. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm using, I'm pretending and that fourth army here, eighth, uh, sorry fourth army direct, they're going to uh, get some uh, supply points from the eighth corps here. What, actually, well, no, that's right. I'm going to transfer uh, command over to eighth corps and they're just going to be dealing with these guys and they're going to kind of like go along here. And what I'm trying to do as part of the narrative is that they're going to be doing the artillery support for these guys. So any hits that are any casualties that I'm, uh, the Austro-Hungarians are going to actually um, take, if they do take any, are going to be from here. Uh, that's the way I'm going to do it. So I'm just pr pretending that they're providing the artillery support and these guys are going in. I mean, you think about it, what the heck is the supply points anyways? It's not as if, uh, you know, you go in unsupplied and it's like, okay, your, your combat effectiveness is halved. I mean, what, I mean, I don't think the game designer was saying, oh, by the way, that means all the infantry, like one out of every two people had a gun or, you know, one out of every two people only had bullets. I mean, that's, you know, that's not, it, you know, that's not the case. So to, for me, this seems kind of a neat way of going, okay, this is what it means. I'm providing actual good art, like enough artillery support that, uh, you know, um, I've whittled down some of the defenders' defenses that uh, my infantry do have some combat effectiveness. That's why I'm looking at it. Uh, I already did one movement over to here. I shifted uh, the Lone Landwehr Brigade that was under 4th uh, Army control that had had to be forced to retreat when the Russians popped out over here and go into there. You know what? I'm actually thinking what I'm doing. This is why I said there's a lot of movement. I think I'm able to move, um, I'm going to move the, these guys over to here and we're going to mount an attack from that spot over. That way I don't have to deal with the woods and I can nail them uh, just from the uh, broken terrain which I think is great. And we're going to get, get them that way. That's why I'm looking at it. I'm just trying to figure out ways of isolating these guys. And here's another one. Uh, that's why I said there's going to be a heck of a lot of movement. I'm going to start moving. I'm not. I'm like I said. I'm not going to go down this little wild goose chase over here. I'm going to bring some. Uh, bring over the third army a bit more over to here. I'm going to try to wrap around here and uh, force the Russians away from here rather than hammering away. Like I said, across a river. I mean, they're just keep, they're just pushing more and more troops uh, towards there. So I thought maybe that'd be a great way. I got ten supply points. 18 strength points sitting right there. Really great spot. And then the other uh, area here is now is I'm just going to, um, uh, you know, obviously going to bring the troops over to here, start wrapping around here, and then I'll start bringing in some replacement troops uh, over. Yeah, this probably sucked a hind tit because I wasn't looking yet again at the. That's what I have to do. I've got to look at the screen while it's, uh, I'm trying to uh, do. So that's obviously because that's what you'll be looking at. Oh, darn it. Oh, well. I'll go take a look and see what's going on. Hopefully I'm having a good time. See ya.